Behind the breathtaking natural beauty and the spectacular landscapes presented by the world's highest mountains in Nepal lie serious limitations to conventional economic activities such as agriculture, industry and other natural resource-based economic activities. The country is renowned for its diverse ethnic and cultural heritage, vast water resources, biodiversity and yet it is among the least developed countries in South Asia. Development potential is seriously undermined by rapid degradation of natural resource base. Agriculture is the mainstay of economy providing a livelihood for three-fourths of the population. Agriculture is traditional and largely depends upon the state of natural resources and vagaries of the monsoon. A number of environmental Challenges such as erosion, over-harvesting of nutrients and recurrent floods have led to land degradation. This land used to be a paddy field, now turned into flood plain. Over 150 sting of new thousand hectares of have been permanently damaged in the last two decades. Today, about 41% of the population is estimated to be undernourished. This low agricultural performance coupled with a high rate of population growth, geographical isolation seem to be at the root of this food insecurity. Where agriculture flourished once, unsustainable agricultural practices and weather variability have to undermine all the progresses that have been achieved to date. The Pajkal Valley produced 60% of the vegetables supplied to Kathmandu now is drying out. River have ceased to flow and farmers have to use water pump for planting rice. Currently, farmland, grassland and degraded land have constantly been expanding largely at the cost of the forests. Deforestation caused by development of infrastructure also threatens Nepal's unique ecosystems. There is a need to minimize the damages and continue to build infrastructure so vital for economic development. Striking a balance between services provided by those ecosystems to sustain human well-being and the increasing development infrastructure is a challenge. As a result of the low economic performance of sectors linked to natural capital, the economy of the country has increasingly been supported by remittances contributing about a quarter of the GDP. Over 1,500 youth head for foreign employment every day. There are more than 1,000 manpower agencies involved in this business. Overall, the changing economic landscape has led to migration from rural to urban areas. A large number of youth has started to look for off-farm employment opportunities. Sustainable agricultural management of natural resources, biodiversity and forestry as well as green infrastructure development have strong potential to develop Nepal's economy. The Poverty Environment Initiative supports Government of Nepal 
to formulate sustainable development plans by mainstreaming poverty environment priorities. Thank you.